stem cell therapy for your pet. It's now affordable with multiple benefits. Learn what it can do for your pet and the important questions you need to ask your vet. He had severe arthritis of his back legs. He's a great Pyrenees, sweet. He's processing the stem cells on site and activating them. She's having stem cell regenerative therapy, a procedure giving pets a second uh, chance. America now has come out with a process that veterinarians all over the world. Stem cell therapy for your pet. It's not just research. With Medivet America, it's a reality. Talk to your vet today. These animals are like our children. You know, they're always dependent on us, but they give us unconditional love back. And so it's that bond that just grows on you because you're taking care of them their whole lives, and then they're taking care of us. Well, my motto has always been, um, don't just live and let live, but live and help live. And, uh, and that's from my heart. It's, it's you know, to take animals at any age, small animals, I don't care if they're puppies, I don't care if they're large dogs, giant breeds, it doesn't matter to me. I don't care if they're mean, I don't care if they're the nicest dogs in the world, I wanna help them. If they're sick, I wanna help them. I got the best job in the world. It's, I, get, I get to help people with their animals. And, and in this practice, I'm working with dogs, cats, um, and exotic species. And for the first time in my career, in my life, the humans are kind of the lab rats for the animals. They're doing all of this research around the globe on humans, and now it's trickling down to our animals because this is a procedure. This isn't a drug. This is all natural. Stem cell regenerative therapy is taking out the body's repair cells. That's basically what stem cells are. They're there to repair the body when it's harmed, degeneration. Aging is a degenerative process. So as we get older, our stem cells decrease because they're always repairing. So what we're doing is we're harvesting some of those sleeping stem cells, if you will, that are inside the fat, and then we're sending them back in in the bucket loads to repair. We're trying to raise up um, the amount of stem cells in the inflamed areas so that we can get some healing done. I'm interested in the adult stem cells, the stem cells that are already in our bodies that have come and developed from the embryo. I mean, we all developed from that, but it's divided several times, now at least eight times before I'm interested in those cells. And what they are is these adult stem cells are repair cells that are sitting in our body. They sit in our tissues, they can sit in our bone marrow, they're in our peripheral blood, you know, they're in our fat, which I really like. And, and if you took a cup full of blood, a sample of blood and took a cup full, you might have 100,000 stem cells there. If you took a cup full of bone marrow, you have about a million stem cells. If you take a cup full of fat, you have one to two billion. So of course, it's a lot easier for me, a lot less painful for the patient to harvest some fat and to process that and use those stem cells. We're photoactivating those stem cells, waking them up, injecting them back into the joints where they're needed and intravenously. And what's coming down the road are these intravenous applications for internal medicine. They're talking about it at all the conferences now. And we, I think in two years, we're gonna see cures for diseases that you and I never thought were curable. And I'm talking about not just animals, but people too. Really exciting stuff coming down the road and real soon. First thing I see when the owners come into the office with their pet is they have questions. And their questions are, could stem cells help my pet's problem? And they wanna know if it's gonna help this uh, um, not getting up the steps, not getting into the car, um, you know, having trouble standing up. They wanna know if it's gonna help that. That's number one. Number two, I'm expecting that animal to be in a lot less pain. And that in itself is enough for just about everybody I speak to. Dr. Mike, if you can reduce my animal's pain, I want to do it. And that is enough. And that's how I feel, too. We don't want them to exist in pain. That's a reasonable expectation. And I actually, I can't guarantee results, but I expect that pain to be reduced dramatically when I treat these animals with stem cells. I'm looking at them to see the risk-reward. Is it worth putting them through general anesthesia, which I take very seriously because we're taking their life in our hands. Is it worth putting them through that risk to try to give them the benefit of pain relief? And age is not a disease. So in most cases, if it's from osteoarthritis, um, it is something that I do elect to do. What else do we want? We want a better range of motion. We want better flexibility. We want to see them get up and down easier. I think that's a reasonable expectation. Am I going to make them a puppy running around for hours a day? No. Or a kitten? No. That is not a reasonable expectation. 
You know, if we look historically at the costs of uh, performing adult stem cell therapy on our pets, with the first phase of the technology that we had, it cost about $3,000, I'd say, on average, to perform this procedure in our pets. Pretty expensive procedure. Now that we're able to do it in-house, we're able to dramatically cut those costs thanks to the technology that MetaVet America brought here, and we can do it for about $1,800. So although it's still expensive, it's much more affordable to more people, and it is cutting-edge technology. It's really good stuff. You know, I got to meet all the principals of MetaVet face-to-face. Uh, -face. I get to talk to them daily if I want. And their mission is to help millions of animals to relieve the suffering that they're going through from osteoarthritis, from ligament injuries, and one day soon from internal medicine problems. And they're supporting the research tremendously. And they're good people. They all are animal owners. They're all animal lovers. And they're kind of what I call a green company. They have all of these natural products. And my favorite being the stem cell kits, because I can apply these to animals and repair diseases that I didn't think I could help before. So as a mission, as a company, help as many animals as possible, millions of animals. This dog started off with very bad deformities, outward, uh, we call it valgus deformities of those front limbs, which was causing tremendous osteoarthritis, of course, on the joints, just from walking. So this dog couldn't walk when we first met it. Now we injected stem cells to try to reduce the inflammation from the osteoarthritis, and the dog's walking again. And Saturday she got up and she started walking. Yeah. And we looked at one another, we almost no, we, were in tears, we no, hugged each we other. Were, we were in we tears. We were in tears. You know, the most wonderful part is seeing that owner's face. When I say to them, when I'm seeing that dog doing so much better on day 30, and I'm looking at them, or day 60, I'm looking at that owners, and they're telling me, Dr. Mike, my dog looks five years younger to us. He's running around, he's doing this. One of my favorite questions is, how does that make you feel? Most of the time, they don't have the words. The tears start. That's how it makes them feel. Hard to describe. <laughs> so, they're, uh, Oh, that's... We're so grateful. Oh, so so when I met the Morris family here in Pittsburgh and their Sheltie, who they call Pup, I started to get excited. Why was I getting excited? Because I now have regenerative medicine to offer. I have this new technology, and with MetaVet America, I can do it here in my own hospital. I can process the cells here. I can do it much more affordably. I don't have to send them across the country and worry about not getting the cells back two days later. I'm getting tremendous numbers, and I know what it does for these animals. So I start getting excited ahead of time, anticipating what I'm going to see, because I've done a number of these, and I see the relief it's giving to these animals in pain. It now offers hope where before there was no hope. It's just a real exciting technology, and I have trouble restraining my exuberance. He used to hesitate quite a bit before he would take those couple of steps to get into the house. Okay. He doesn't do that hesitation anymore. He's, okay, he's there and he's in. On a pain scale from zero to five, zero being no pain, five being severe pain. You got pain. no pain. He's I don't zero. think Excellent. he has anything. Excellent. And I want to tell you, please go out and speak to your veterinarian. It's available, it's affordable, and it's incredible. What we can do for our pets today that I couldn't do two years ago is just mind-boggling to even me. I've been a veterinarian for 24 years. I want everybody to see what benefits these stem cells can give us. It's regenerative medicine. We're using the body to help repair itself. We're using cells that were intended for repair, where they can unbiasedly go through the body, seeking out inflammation and trying to help repair what's causing pain. And to me, that's what it's all about, trying to relieve pain and suffering. Same day treatment. Affordable. If your animal suffers from osteoarthritis, has trouble running, getting up steps, or jumping into the car, stem cell therapy may help. Stem cell therapy for your pet. It's not just research. With MediVet America, it's a reality. Contact your vet today.